and I'm your host with Singster.tv and we are still here rocking on the green carpet, uh, Dances with Film, and I'm here with... Wayne Mitchell. Chris. Eduardo. Chase. Jesse Celadon. Which is one of the lead actors and these are the co-directors and writers, uh, Wayne and Eduardo. So tell me a little bit about the film and where it takes place and who wants to talk first? Uh, Soledad is the name of our film. It takes place here in Los Angeles. That's why we're so psyched to get invited by Dancing with Films because we wanted to represent in our it's a big city. deal. It's a very big deal to us. Uh, but our lead character Jesse plays a lonely uh, limousine driver who has a very kind of isolated existence until one night he is uh, forced to defend a client from being sexually assaulted by her prom date. That's this guy. Is the he's the date that sexually assaults the prom. You douchebag. So we we're really fortunate to have this guy to to make our to have, help. Jesse make his feature debut. I mean, this is a dream 20 years in the making with this film. I mean, this is a man who's given up his life to support uh, disadvantaged kids that are supported by the state. He runs group home in Bakersfield, and he's going to be able to set a great example for them by living out his dream and starring in this film. I love it. So how was it when you got casted in this film to act in it as a lead character? That's a big deal. Well, and being here today, being interviewed by me, no. <laughs> that's an even bigger deal. It, it's, it's a bit surreal. But I got to tell you, ever since I was 16, 16 years old, when I met this guy, Eddie, I wanted to be an actor. He showed me what speech was, he showed me what acting was, and I said, I want to do that. That's what I want to do for a living. And here we are, so many years later, making a movie. A green carpet being interviewed. You know what I mean? Job well done. So, t it had to be hard for you as a character embodying this sadistic character, yeah. but none of those traits in that character ap apply with you, who you really are, right? I mean, uh, deep down a little, no, I'm kidding. Uh, deep down. No, I mean, I, Eddie has been so great throughout this. Uh, when he approached me to, uh, to play Preston, you know, I, I was really scared off the, off, the, off the bat because I've never played anyone this horrible or any, uh, this bad. I mean, like, getting in that mindset, it's very scary. He completely cultured me, and I, he, he threw me into that, into that place. He made sure I was there, and it was, it was good. It was great. It was awesome, and I, I wanted to do more of this. Congratulations. So tell me a little about your character in the movie, the film. I'm Jordan. I'm the uh, sadistic older brother who... Uh, you help him. I help him. In fact, I, I, I push him into doing it, and if he doesn't do it, he gets his ass beat at home secretly. But uh, it's pretty much something happens to him, and anything that happens to our family, I kind of take control, and uh, I go... I go after the big guy here. It's a, it's a David and Goliath match right there. Yeah. That's awesome. Yeah. What well, message do you hope the community receives after reviewing this film or watching it and watching it? Well, more than anything, the thing that we're playing with is that it's always better to live life with other people no matter what the cost. And then the other tagline we like to say is that the thing about memories is you have to have the experiences first. Right. And this movie is an experience. It's been more of an experience for us making this thing. We hope we can bring a little bit of that across from the film exactly. because we're great friends now that, you know, these guys, we didn't even know them before we started and now they're like our, our family. Of course. You know, but uh, yeah, definitely, uh, the, you know, life's worth living with other people. Well, that just happened with Soledad, correct? Soledad. 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 Thanks for watching. That just happened. It premieres Sunday, May 31st. Sunday. May 31st, Sunday. Make sure you go and watch it. Yeah.